Hello, my name is Christopher and today I'm going to show you how to set up Ring on Home Assistant. This makes it to where if you have uh, Ring battery devices like Ring doorbells or anything, you can be able to set up a home automation Home Assistant and alert you that that one's going dead or anything like that. So a little bit about this series on Vibra Tech World is we're going over uh, installing software on, uh, for home automation. Uh, installing server software, installing uh, home automations inside of Home Assistant and scripted and everything like that. So, so if you're into that, subscribe, comment, like, and let's get started. So I'm going to start in a fresh install of Home Assistant that I've been using in a couple videos. So... I'm going to go over to settings right here and I'm going to um, scroll down to uh, integrations and then um, I'm going to go down to the bottom right add integration and then I'm going to say ring I'm going to type up in the brand name ring and then right here I'm going to put in my ring account and if you do get an error in this first you'll just try it again and then you put in your two-factor authentication if you have one. So I'm going to pause it right here. So once you put in your username and your two-factor authentication code and your password and everything like that, uh, you'll be presented with um, a success. And then you've cr uh, created your ring setup. So I'm going to go down here to finish. And then you can see on the rings as I have uh, different rings. So I'm going to go over to extra ring. And you can see that you can look at the ring camera. And um, you can see the battery percentage. Then you can go in here and you can see an entity ID to where you can go over there and set up home automations for that. You can go backwards. You can see when it's dinged, when somebody's rung the door doorbell. You can see the last activity in it, the last ding, last motion, and motion currently, or if it's clear. And then you can see the volume level on the ring. So you can also see the logbook of when it's uh, do doing anything. It's become available, become unavailable, different things like that. You can go over here and you can see all your devices, like 13 devices, 90 entities. You can see your email that you're, is connected to Ring. Um, you can go in here and you can see other things, like you can look at a... Um, a chime. And then uh, you can ring the chime, everything like that. So, and then um, you can also see the volume on the chime. So, that's how to get Ring in Home Assistant. So, that's how to get uh, Ring on Home Assistant. This makes it to where you can easily ha have home automations, like if the Ring battery gets down, you know when to charge it, or you can also uh, create a dashboard uh entity list and order by the ones that are need to be replaced uh, sooner or recharged sooner so this makes it to where you can easily keep up with your rings and what they're doing and what your ring doorbells are doing your chimes are doing and things like that so if you like this tutorial subscribe comment like and support the channel and um if you need support you can go down to big bear community down, down in the description i have a link for it it's a discord and you can join it and ask questions and also, uh, if you need support, you can also comment on the videos. So, stay tuned for more.